Hello, with this uh, short video I would like to show you some uh, features of uh, Rianne and uh, how to use it uh, for a normal uh, excursion. As you can see we are in a quite stretch environment with the sky covered quite partially so you, you might expect some uh, uh, little error on uh, GPS uh, position since we don't see all the sky. Let's see. I have installed it on my phone. This is a Nokia 6110 navigator. It has its own uh, GPS uh, integrated, but uh, of course you can use normal phones uh, since 2004 with external GPS device connected via Bluetooth. I've installed the application uh, on my desktop, just start it. it when it starts it asks me a few information. Uh, I would like uh, to start a new path or or continuing the, the old one, I say OK, start new one. It asks me if I would like to send automatically the path at some delays from five minutes to one hour. This depends also on network operator coverage. If, it's, uh, if it is quite a few coverage, it's better to, to put manual sending. If you know that your area is covered, you can set automatically quite easily. Be careful if you set automatic on a low coverage that you might kill your battery. I sell I say manual. Okay. It asks me if I am aware that the application takes my position. Yes. And now it starts Since you can see, it already takes the first position. Now I might put my mobile phone on my bag and uh, make the, the excursion. Just be careful to put on the upper side, upper level of your bag, otherwise it might have problems in taking the right position or might give you quite big error. On the top of uh, the screen you can have some information like longitude, latitude, height, how many meters I've made and uh, some uh, error precision since uh, I've put a destination, I've set a destination, it also gives me how many meters I have to reach the destination. This is a green uh, arrow on screen, it gives me the direction and uh, how many meters left. As you can see, the north is always up the screen and uh, there is a compass on a screen also that gives me the north behind me actually. So that's right that the path is coming down the screen. You can see the height levels during the path. Uh, if I change the direction, the compass changes also and uh, of course the destination stays on my right you can see at some point I can uh, set up a, a tag okay you can set a right 
displays picture. And uh, attack like snow. Snow and save. Okay. Now I can go back and see my tags by left and right. I can zoom in by up and down the joystick and uh, now I can send the path for example together with my tags uh, of course I'll send the path it asks me if I would like to set a password for this path on server this means that when someone would like to see my path on server should know this password. You can leave empty for public path. Okay, sending. It asks me which operator. Okay, and done. Yeah, okay, fine. Now you, you may already see this path navigating the website. I can either send via normal SMS to uh, anybody via SMS I can complete the message it already contains the current location in longitude latitude you may send uh, the, your position to another Ariane this will uh, simply set his destination to reach you. So he will get uh, the green arrow, arrow to your position and uh, how many meters it has to reach you. On the path you can uh, reset the height. Here for example it says 2084 really we are about 2050 so the height is set and on a correct value destination you can set your own uh, destination actually you can see my destination in longitude latitude and can change it down here I can also set this current position as destination if I would like to come back on this point so now return on my and you can see already the green arrow pointing to where I was just few I mean few moments ago and uh, six meters etc okay for now you can end this little presentation and uh, we can see the resulting path on uh, web page see you later